Hello everyone, my name is Sarah and today I'm going to show you how to, how to thread a needle on a Singer sewing machine. So first of all, we're going to start up here. You're going to take this piece off and then put your spool on this post here. Then we'll slide this back on so that your thread will unwind there. And then we're going to proceed. Uh, this machine happens to have arrows showing you where to go, but I'll go ahead and walk you through how to thread these. So we will just slip this behind the back of this little piece here. Then we'll also come in back of this piece here and just pull it through. And then we'll follow this groove down all the way to here and there's an arrow that's showing us to wrap it around so we'll go ahead and bring that up and this thing might not always be up like this uh, so in order to make sure that that's up you'll want to twist this knob toward you until until you start to see that come up again. It'll appear here in just a second. There we go. Okay. So then you'll want to go around the back of that as well. And then that'll just slide into a groove there. Okay, now we're going to follow this line down here. And then we are going to wrap this around this little bar here. So we'll come to the right of it and go behind. Now it's behind this. Next, we'll come to this smaller one right next to the needle. And there's another opening on the right side. So we'll just go up behind that one. I'm trying to keep my fingers out of the way. It's usually not this hard to thread. See, now we're behind that. And now we're right next to the needle. So you'll want a nice crisp end on your thread. So use a pair of good scissors or nippers to clip that off. So you've got that nice crisp end there. Now, you'll want to make sure that the thread isn't wrapped around the needle at all before you thread it. And you'll Hold it kind of close to the end of the thread. And push it in. And once you've gotten it in a little bit, what I like to do is I like to uh, press my index finger. Oh, and now I unthreaded it. I'll try it again. Okay. Now that it's in a little bit, I'll just push not too hard with my index finger but enough to keep the thread in place and I'll hold the the rest of the thread out of the way and then I'll just pull with my other hand the thread through I'll hold on to this so that it doesn't wrap around the needle at all so it's just flush with the front of the needle here and then on the presser foot We've got a slit here, and we'll just bring the thread through there and around to the back, and there you have it. Thank you for watching this video. I know that sewing can become an expensive hobby really quickly, so if you're interested in saving money on sewing supplies or machine parts, uh, go ahead and visit cashbackadventure.com uh, to get cash back on all of your sewing expenditures.